uh, once again, thank you so much for your, you know, love and support, you know, um, all your comments, you know, I read every single one of your comments, uh, you know, we've achieved 11,000 subscribers, it's just crazy just knowing the fact that, um, you know, day after day after day after day, you know, week after week, you know, people keep subscribing and they're just, you know, um, sending positive vibes, you know, again, reading your comments um, really just, you know, keeps me going to keep doing better and better and better and trying to be as helpful as ever, okay? Um, once again, thank you for watching. Welcome to Learning with Lenny. Uh, this is, uh, so, yeah, it's bonus lesson 47. Um, what I just want to, uh, you know, pass the message across is, so the topic is the benefits of using YouTube in uh, the classroom. So, for example, um, why do we create content? Basically, it's for people to know about um, things we like and what we are doing and what needs that maybe people have that we can we could help out, right? So, is YouTube good and is it um, good enough to be used in a classroom? Um, so, that's where we want to actually share with you, where I want to share with you, where the first thing is uh, it reduces the expense of online education. So, YouTube, as you know, you, you can watch it for free. You're watching me for free right now. Um, but what you need to understand is, if you're a teacher and you want to use uh, YouTube, right? Well, it actually helps as well in terms of teaching uh, students. For example, um, you could have somebody like me who's actually running a topic and, you know, it could be a topic that you want people to know about. Um, the same topic could be run by some other people and the points could be slightly different. So it's still learning from different people. So the good part here is it actually reduces the expense of online education. Number two, YouTube is a wealth of educational resources available to users. So in a classroom, if you want to teach anything, all you have to do is just go to YouTube, key it in and automatically you get a whole bunch of uh, content comes out which you can actually utilize in the classroom as well. So if you're a teacher and you want to teach people but you have no idea what you actually want to pass uh, the message across, you could always go to YouTube. Or the other thing is you go to YouTube, get all this information and you actually teach it as well. So that's the good part about YouTube uh, being utilized you know um, in the classroom as well because people can actually watch different people it could be their idols it could be people who are really famous um, you know who's actually running the same kind of content that you're doing so it could be anything in a classroom okay it could be um, for science it could be for the biology it could be for maths you know it could be for anything okay the third thing here is to facilitate the sharing of work of students. So when you have students who actually do uh, work as well, what you can do is upload it to uh, YouTube or you have different students from different places all over the world who's uploaded their work, which you are trying to do and you're trying to pass that message across to people as well. So it's really important for you to understand that uh, YouTube is a platform where you are able to share content of the same similar uh, things uh, from different various uh, content creators. Okay, so it's really important for you to understand that. Um, number four, to display labor laboratories and experiments. So again, I could teach people right now how to do a science project. All I need to do is just basically put it into YouTube and it comes out. So what I'm saying is do not think that you, you're trying to cheat the system where you are not someone who knows something and you're just putting it to make money of it that does not work what i'm trying to say is you can actually benefit by actually showing this content to your students as well because a lot of students will actually start to understand that they can go to youtube learn it um, understand what my my teacher is saying and things like that as well okay um the last thing here is to make your material helpful with transcription so people can read understand it's not necessary that you just have to know english it could be different languages as well so when people start understanding what they're doing they begin they begin to understand how to do it so it's really important for you to understand that at the end of the day people there are many people out there who want to do things but are not aware of how to do it and this could be the platform for you where you create things and you can be uh, a person who teaches people in the classroom. You can be a person that is actually um, teaching the classroom, you know, um, that allows you to share information, share things, 
you know for example right now what i'm passing across is a message right a message of what could can be done to progress in future to make yourself a youtuber to make yourself a teacher a trainer a coach a content creator so it's really important that you understand that and when you do understand it it's only because of the 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 reason that the message is being passed across so it's really important for you to understand that a lot of people out there know and want to do things but they just don't have the resources or they don't know where to find these resources and this is one of the platforms that could actually help a lot of people out there okay so once again um, I really hope this makes sense because um, the benefits of using YouTube in the classroom is important because you you actually don't need a lot of teachers you don't need a lot of things you could uh, run a business where you know it's it's an online platform you can do a lot of things out there that actually helps you in terms of uh, teaching training uh, coaching managing people as well okay just make sure you know which is the platform and how to use that platform and how to use it as a resource to make uh, it really important towards uh, the people who are looking up to you and wanting to learn from you okay so once again i hope this makes sense i hope it helps you uh, if it does please uh, give me a thumbs up please share it out um, there are you know a lot of people who've learned from all of you who are sharing it thank you so much uh, it really means a lot to me uh, most importantly is if this is the first time you're watching please make sure to subscribe um, and please follow uh, you know my channel i do have a facebook uh, channel as well please um, you know get on to facebook Look for Learning with Lenny. There's a lot more other topics there that could actually uh, help you out. It's shorter versions as well, you know, for you to just get those key points, understand it, and uh, be successful in what you do. Okay? So once again, thank you so much for watching. It's a pleasure always to uh, teach and train and, you know, uh, keep passing on these messages to you guys. So I will see you in the next bonus lesson.